All right, let's just go ahead and jump right into it. Pick the story to experience. Do we get any sort of indication of the story or just or girl? All right, we're going to go. Oh, here we go. He comes from a great family who are descendants of the founding father. Cheerful and optimistic, he's a young boy with an unwavering and kind heart. Having his life saved by the OSF when he was young, he was inspired to join the OSF as a volunteer to be able to save others. He fights close quarters with a combination of quick sword attacks and psycho psychokinesis abilities. There is two different stories. Like these, apparently these two stories are like completely different. Like they like they intersect with each other, but they're not. You're not just playing like a different gender. Like it, it's legit two different stories. So I don't know which one I'm gonna start with first. Let's see what this one says. Scouted by the OSF, she was an elite cadet at the academy, always at the top of her class. Cool, rational, and different to others. The only person she's opened up to opened up to is her adoptive sister. She is extremely loyal to her. She will do anything for her sister. She fights at range with a combination of range, multi-blade attacks, and psychokinesis abilities. Um You know what? I'm gonna start with the guy just because he has a sword. He has a sword on his back. That gives him the dub. Ooh, there's a photo mode. You have to live. No matter what. Okay. The virtual brain link cable will now be connected. This will hurt much more than it did in training. Be strong. Systems all green. Beginning SAS cable connection. Is this for real? Is this the Matrix anime? Close enough. Anime Matrix? Jesus Christ, man. <laughs> feels like it messed up my eye good seems like you're okay this aptitude test will determine your platoon assignment do your best yes sir oh my eyes back to normal let's go yuito sumaragi identity confirmed. yuito okay the other suppression force aptitude test will now begin exterminate all others He's got main character syndrome. You're not wrong. <laughs> oh, what the? That was jarring. Oh, the movement feels weird. <laughs> Yes, so I know how to jump. Be able to make my childhood dreams come true. Ooh. All right, maybe I don't know how to jump. Yeah, the movement feels weird. The camera feels very disconnected from me. Like, I don't know how to explain it. What the? Be able to handle any kind of other with my psychokinesis power. <laughs> Just toss a barricade at him. Lock onto an enemy with right, uh, right stick. Press again to disengage. Locking on an enemy is a basic tactic. Yada yada yada. Yep, got it. 
Lock on. Ow. Take that barricade. Can I throw the car? Oh, we can throw the car! It's not centered on a character. Yeah, it's not. Can I? Hold on. Camera distance, close, normal, far. All right, that feels a little bit better. Putting the camera tracking on kind of helped. Yuito fights using his power, psychokinesis, and with his sword. The attack range of the sword is short, but he can overwhelm enemies with his fast attacks. So weapon attacks X slightly charged psychokinesis gauge. Use a mix of weapon and psychokinesis to dispatch the enemies. And any enemy with a weapon attack will automatically lock you onto the enemy. Automatic lock on a target switching can be okay. You weren't kidding, the sword is kind of short. Cool animation though. Form a step with B. Okay, so that's a dodge. Or a dash. Yeah, it's like a dash. Okay. There's a chance she would know something about her. I have to make it through this exam, no matter what. I'm gonna be honest, locking on doesn't really feel like it helps. Rising Slash! Alright. Pretty simple. Dash, dash, Rising Slash. Take him to class. Now watch me rap. Up, 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 up. Okay, I'm gonna stop now. <laughs> oh, Jesus. The instructor always said the most dangerous thing is being careless at the end. Let's keep this up. All right. Take the barricade. Let's keep this up. Rising slash. Oh, I missed. All right. All right, I'm slowly getting the hang of this. I just gotta get. I, I think the main thing I just gotta get used to is the camera. Like it feels better now with the setting change, but it still feels a little weird. Press Y while moving to perform a sweeping moving spin attack in a wide area. That was like a heavy attack. Okay. Ooh. Form a weapon attack with X when landing a psychokinesis attack. Close to this with a rush follow up attack. All right, so we got combos now. Dope. Hey, how about I take you to school? Uh, uh. This game is perfect for me. It's gonna let me do so many stupid puns. Uh. Hello, delivery. And it's not the Giorno. It's death. I need to stop. <laughs> I need to stop, Jesus. When an X or Y attack lands, performing a psychokinesis attack by high holding RT will result in a powerful psychokinesis follow-up attack. It consumes a lot of the psychokinesis gauge to restore it by using okay. Cringe. Command cringe. Damn. I should add a command cringe to the uh Twitch chat. I keep trying to do Stinger, like from DMC. Maybe that's something you can unlock later, because I feel like you're missing a stinger, like pep attack. Throw the bus. Oh, there we go, because, yeah, okay, I'm starting to get the hang of that combo system, because you can, like, you can still do the follow-up attack after the psychokinesis, so you can combo, use the psychokinesis, and then use the rush to get back into it. Learning a rush follow-up attack and psychokinesis follow-up attack skills increases the amount of times they can be used consecutively. Oh, it's literally it's literally what I just said. Okay. <laughs> if I do everything I learned from my training, oh what the I should be able to win. I have to. <laughs> Alright, this thing is large and in and in charge. Not for long. Throw the bus! Rush in! Oh, I wasn't close enough. 
Ooh. Throw something else. I gotta show him the Carfax. Ooh. This thing isn't really attacking me. I should be able to handle it. Ugh. There we go. You can view what you learned in the tutorial. Okay. Mission successful. This concludes the aptitude test. All right, not bad. The combat seems the combat system's kind of interesting. I wonder how much more in depth it gets. Okay, that ends your training. You're an official member of the OSF from tomorrow. Cadets now have 24 hours of free time until then. Make sure to get some rest before your duties tomorrow. Understood. The game looks good too. I kind of like I like this art style they have going. Hey Yuito, how was the test? Nagi, how did it go? Nagi Carman. On the test, I'd say that I did. It's probably Carmen, but I'm gonna call him Carman. Kind of good or pretty good. We were looking rough when the SAS cable connected. Huh, that really hurt. It was fine after I got used to it, though. Sounds like you had fun. <laughs> That's so like you. <laughs> so tomorrow will be OSF, just like we dreamed. I can't believe it. Mm. Yeah. What's up? You don't sound very excited. No, I'm happy too. Didn't I tell you? I was saved by an OSF soldier when I was a kid. So I wanted to be one as well. But... But what? Lately, I've been wondering if that's it. The end of my goal. Oh, why does he have those gloves, man? I'm here today because someone saved me. Just so, wear a full glove. What is that weird, like, to save more people's lives. half just under the thumb glove? Such a big burden like that. Just Even wear a full limits. glove. That looks dumb. OSF, so we fight others. Oh, his Let's coolness factor just dropped by like 20. Now. Yeah, you're right. I guess I was just being a little anxious. First, I have to become a real member of the OSF. Thanks. Your gratitude is greatly appreciated, Mr. Yuito. So you're going to report to Sumeragi Tomb later? I hate telling the ancestors every little thing. So annoying. <laughs> well, it's not just that. Man, if he Sumeragi needs to feel something with this hand, he can right take now. the full glove off. He doesn't need to have this weird half glove thing. What? Sumeragi Tomb is your family grave. I know it's a tourist spot, but they do things like that? I heard it's happening more and more. It's something my father decided on. Oh, right. I have to send a message to my dad and brother. Your father won't reply anyway. I know he didn't want you to join the OSF, but man, that's cold. He's always smiling when he's at the council. It's like he's not even two-faced, but three-faced. I mean, he's a politician after all. Oh. Anyways, <laughs> I only send him simple messages. <laughs> he's a politician, There's so he has to be three-faced. What does it say? This game is sending a message already. You pushed through. A direct compliment from Chief Sumeragi. You're guaranteed a promotion. <laughs> You're making fun of me. My brother's not going to coddle me just because he's the chief of the OSF. Okay, sorry. <laughs> sure you are. If you're really sorry, you'll give me the keychain from the fortune you get from Baki. All right, I got it. I'll pull a fortune and give you my keychain. Then you have to help me pick up the ladies. I have a better chance when you're with me. What? That's just me doing extra work for you. You got a promotion once and it was the worst day of your life? Doesn't sound like a promotion then. Oh, is this actually like an open world game? Oh shit. You really do like 
Baki, though. He kind of makes me feel nice. Like a stuffed animal I had when I was a kid. When you were a kid? Has Baki been around that long? Hasn't he? I can just feel his cuteness in my DNA. Um... Am I not able to run? I have no clue. Alright, where am I supposed to be going? This way. At least, I think this is the way I'm supposed to go? Yeah, this looks right. Also, what is this? I see you. There are locations where you can obtain items. Some type of item. Alright, I got some type of item. Thank you, game. I appreciate you telling me exactly what it was. Hey, look at this! It's some type of item! The recorder wearing yellow? I am air and shadow. Read the brain message carefully for details. Alright. Let's go ahead and get our first save up here. Nope. Hey, this is a shop. What can we buy? You can buy and sell battle items and equipment at shops. Add-ons will be marked with an asterisk. Oh yeah, I got the, uh, like, deluxe edition. So there's a whole bunch of DL- Yeah, I think this is all DLC stuff. <laughs> Holy shit, there's a lot- What the- Jesus! Um... Is there an accept all button? Alright, I guess we're going through this one by one. Pay to win. I guess it is pay to win. Deepening bonds with your companions through the add-on can unlock EX powers. Trigger EX bond episodes. You will need to meet the following conditions with the companion. Do the bond episodes to the end. Reach a bond level of 6. Give them a special gift. Alright. Dude, this is a bunch of ad- You can play episode Karen, Unknown History. Some challenges in the main menu after completing certain objectives. You can- when you are in the hideout. Alright, I'm not gonna lie, some of these add-on things are kind of spoiling stuff, because I think I recognize who that character was. <laughs> I'm not sure if the anime- the anime might not be a prequel, the anime might just actually be like... The story from the game. Not the Karen episode you yell at the monsters for not finding your food fast enough. I mean, I'd play it. I mean, why not? <laughs> hey, I can buy a sword. Oh, I can sell my sword. I don't want to sell my sword. <laughs> Alright, well, I got a bunch of stuff. Can I use any of it? Equipment. Oh, we got DLC weapons. Kind of like... Uh, what's the word I'm looking for? It's like a royal sword. Like, you know, like... A king of England uses this sword or has this sword attached to his hip, but he never uses it because it's mainly for decoration. The Firefly. Whoa! RGB Gamer Sword! Oh, we're gonna be cranking 90s with this one, boys! I actually kind of like the shape of this one. The Bone Eater. Ew. I, I don't like the look of this one. Poseidon Slayer? Jesus! The scabbard is pretty cool, but the sword itself doesn't even look like a sword. That looks like it'd break on the first thing you swing it on. 
The final strike. Oh my god. It's just a serrated blade. That's making sure that whoever you hit this, whoever gets sliced by this is dying. Jesus. Doesn't even look like it fits in the scabbard, though. The King Leo. Huh. That one looks the most basic out of all of them so far. The Poseidon Slayer does look like an architect's high school project. It's like, build a bridge. It honestly does look like it has bridge support. Look at it with the triangles and stuff. That is an architect's high school project. What is this? The fresh B113? I don't even have a scabbard for it. Where do I put it? It looks kind of cool, but kind of dumb at the same time. <laughs> the blazing sword. Holy. Dude, I'm the lords of the cinders. Dark Souls is calling my name with this sword. Let me go relight the bonfire. I might actually use that one. Oh, that was the last one. Oh, this is from the Tales game. A sword that appears in Tales of Arise, which can only be wielded by certain people. But this is a replica that you can hold with your hands. Okay. Well, I don't want to, like, break the game, so let's not use it. I'm not sure how strong the DLC weapons are, so I don't want to end up being overpowered from the get-go. So let's not use those right now. Give me two guesses where that sword goes. Enhances the powers. I'm not going to guess where the sword goes. <laughs> Plug in that raises the health and defense of the user. EXP bonus plug in. 100 plus. X Damn, that's double XP. Oh, that one just prevents you from dying. It's kind of broken. I'm going to wear this one. Extra money and extra XP. Oh, we got a tires now. Red battle attire. I'm not going to lie. This looks pretty dope. And look, he has full on gloves. I might actually, I might actually use this one. The wolf hood. Ooh. Oh, this one's kind of cool, too. Dude, I like the shoes on this one. Youth the tier faith. All right, it's like a casual wear. Scarlet hair. What the? Why do his legs look like extra skinny? What the f- What is this? <laughs> no. Just no. <laughs> um. Let's go with this one, I guess. Yeah, we decked out now. Look at us. We swagging now. Alright, let's keep on moving. We wasted enough time. Get on with the story. Hopefully I keep my outfit. Oh, I do in cutscenes. I thought they were going to default me back to the OG costume. There are a lot of people paying their respects. Huh, those two girls over there were cute. What? Really? I didn't see them. I can't believe your family grave is a tourist spot. You sure are an elite. My dad and brother are, but I'm not. It's like one of those grand families. Your father is the chairman, and your brother is chief of the OSF. Plus, you're descended from Yakumo Sumeragi, our founding father. He's the hero who saved humanity from the spring of extinction. I wonder what he looked like. Maybe he looked like you. It's starting to sound like ancestor. nepotism. Not gonna lie. He's my ancestor, but that was 2,000 years ago. 
I certainly don't feel like his descendant. The only record of him is in that mask. Even if they say he's my ancestor, how could I be sure? Ah, uh, I get it. He does look like the villain in a horror movie. His face was injured in the spring of extinction, right? Oh, crap. Your dad would get mad at me for saying that about our country's forefather. It's no big deal. But you are. The Sumeragi house is known for having lots of authority. Your dad got mad when you said you didn't want to be a politician or a bureaucrat. Enough about my family. Let's go get a fortune from Baki. You're not going to pray to your ancestors? Okay, let's get going then. Okay, got it. Let's look at the same time. Yeah, they're right. definitely cutting back these on the animations for these cutscenes. The Ready? Ready? Go. Go! Very bad luck. Me too. A lot That's of still shots. Sign. Oh, I'm dying. Let's go to a cafe. What was that transition? What the What was that transition? Yeah, we already got Baki's keychain. Why don't we head to Vision Town? Oh, you can move. Wait, you can move the camera during that? Hold on. I got a text. A text message. All right. I don't feel like reading through them. Go ahead and head back to Main Street. Alright, looks like we're going this way. Yeah, those cutscenes, they definitely do not spend time animating them. It's basically just, here's the area, still shot, cut to the, cut, cut to the uh, rectangular portraits. And even the portraits aren't really uh, animated. It's just lip flaps moving. Oh, what the fuck? Others? Oh, now we got a cutscene. An other alert, but today's forecast said the threat level here was zero. It's a plant. What? Others? What are they doing in the city? All units, double time. Go on the second way through. Transfer warning. They're deploying the Scarlet Guardians. <laughs> is it time for me to get to work or what? Why is this scene animated? Because it's the Scarlet Guardians. <laughs> oh shit, they're pulling up. Karin and Fubuki. Oh, now it's not animated? What the fuck? <laughs> Yeah, you can move the camera, dude. He's <laughs> why. Hey, it's Karen. <laughs> Fubuki Spring. Septentrion, Karen, Travers, and Fubuki Spring. Karen Regiment, Fubuki Regiment. Oh, it's Karen, not Karen. I'm gonna keep calling him Karen. <laughs> Civilians, head to it's the funnier. Shelter. Karen and Fubuki. They really couldn't animate wow. this. Hey Yuito, we have to get to the shelter too. We're not real soldiers yet. Uh, yeah. No, let me fight. Hey, what does that say? That very bad luck was a curse. Let's get to the shelter. I can't even see the fighting. Oh my god. Alright, fine. Wait, 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 wait. No, there's something back there. You can't stop me. Alright, maybe you can. The other was defeated with one blow. 
Septentrion First Class. Brain Eater Major General Karin Travers is amazing. The Brain Eater? Whoa. Damn, what a name. Velocity evasion into an electric blast? Karin Travers is the only one who can use that many powers. He's so cool. Doesn't he have the ability to copy other people's powers? Yeah, that's why he can use all those powers. It's basically cheating. The other is fighting back, but Major General Travers is unfazed. He just teleport? Major freezes the other without hesitation. I like Fubuki better just because the Fubuki has ice powers. Nothing against the Septentrion class. Ice powers are Mommy? top class. Uh oh. Hey, are you serious? We're not real soldiers yet. Brother, there's two people in danger. Move. It's necessary to fight the others. We can't. If the instructors find out, we can't just watch people die. I'm going. You call for backup. I don't want to go alone. I'll go with you. Thanks. Uh, don't look so happy. It's not like I want to go. You were. T oh my best. God. What? You think I don't know that? I'll take the right, you take the left. Got it. I'm not gonna lie, I'm not a big fan of Nagi. Dude just complains to complain. Psychokinesis! Bro, do I have to pay these trucks and stuff that I'm using? Like, does the city pay for any damage I cause? Because I definitely just chuck the car. Ugh. not safe here get to a shelter y yes sir be careful there are more others can you keep fighting uh, sure why not i'll take them on okay let's go i mean i'll help you it's not like you're gonna fight them by yourselves the item menu is displayed on the bottom left of the screen during battle down to use an item switch items and we can't spam items okay good to know hey don't, don't worry they have vehicle insurance Ow. Ooh. Dodge. Dodge. Should I just throw a shopping cart? <laughs> I want to see all the random items I can throw at these guys. Ugh. 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 Scummy pool. Ow. Hey, isn't Nagi supposed to be helping me? I don't see him here. Just saying. I, I only see myself fighting these guys. <laughs> she paid off the car five minutes before the invasion started. Yeah, she'll be fine. Oh, we got some bikes. Let me chuck a bike at someone. Was that the last of them? Damn. Did that plant have high heels? Oh, it does have a high heels. Now die! Someone else just used psychokinesis. That definitely wasn't me. That's odd. You a civilian? Hey, it's the other protagonist. Huh? It's her. You have to live. No matter what. You're OSF? Oh, no, I'm a cadet. I see. Either way, our goal is the same. What do you mean, goal? Are you an idiot? Huh? Shh. Something's coming. Huh? What's coming?
It's a cow. Here we go. Huh? Okay. What happened to Nagi? He's just gone now. <laughs> All right, Nagi's gone. It's just us now. You can use brain cells. Do you see what's happening? Let's talk after we take out the others. Not yet. Alright, let me use some light jelly to heal. Ow! Dodge, dodge. Oh, Jesus, okay. Special delivery! Call it Prime, because it's there fast. I, I, I need to learn how to fight, because I'm just not- Oh! Jesus! Dodge! Dodge! Get away from me! Don't kick me! I'll kick you! Ooh. Oh, what a dodge! There goes the Bugatti! It's charging! Oh, I'm out of psycho power. Don't worry, we don't need him anymore. We have Y2 now. Yeah, I guess. <laughs> the female protagonist is here. Nagi is no longer needed. <laughs> Look out. Good work. That should take care of all the other readings around here. Yes. Kasane! I saved that boy. Nagi! You're okay! Yeah, Naomi saved me. Man, I must look like an idiot. I'm just glad you're not hurt. Thanks, sis. Oh, you two are sisters? Yeah, they're both OSF cadets like us. Let me introduce myself. Is Nagi, Nagi gonna Carmen. make me try to hook this him up with Sumeran. Naomi? Or Kisane? Naomi Randall. This is gonna be like a double date sister, thing. Kasane Randall. So it was you making all that trouble. Who the fuck? The Scarlet Guardians have eradicated the others. Huh? Saved Ryujin Ward in that amazing victory over the others. What? Uh, well, what is this? A victory interview? It is. How do you feel? Alrighty, alrighty. That's enough filming for today. Spring. I don't know how to say her first name. Arashi? Just who are these rookies? What? Nagi? Huh? Where is everyone? Huh? What the fuck just happened? Oh, he teleported us. We should be able to talk here. Uh, what's going on? I'm Luca Travers. Luca Travers. Your Septentrion sixth class Luca Travers? It's embarrassing when you put it that way, but yes, that's correct. Are you all cadets? Please open your personal port so I can confirm your identities. No objections? Thank you. <laughs> So all four of you are OSF cadets. Cadets aren't allowed to fight others. I, I'm sorry. Isn't OSF responsible for allowing others to enter the local airspace and putting civilians in danger? Damn. Kasane, you shouldn't say something like that. Nah, 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 let her call him out. Those are some harsh words, but you're right, Cadet Kasane Randall. I'm sure you all have something to say, but first report to OSF headquarters. Keep away from the press. Got it? Understood. What's that? Oh, casualties from the battle. 
Two OSF troopers on guard duty were killed. I think it's censored, but it's best not to look too close. Huh? Why? Because others eat human brains. Yes. Looking at headless bodies can have negative lasting effects on your mental health. Oh, I just imagined it. They should teleport or report them out. It's too far to the morgue and powers aren't omnipotent. We have time, so let's talk a little. I'm sure you know. But Interesting one that they censored like one that. Type of power. But each kind of power has peculiarities and aptitude. Just as there are types of powers, each person has strengths and weaknesses. To use them in combat, we must rely on devices to lessen the stress on the brain. That's why things that can be accomplished without powers, or things with low priority, are done manually. Right, sorry. Now then, I'll be going. That'd be us if we didn't get the others first. Is teleporting really necessary then? I mean, you could just walk manually. Plus, right? We'll stick together and become great fighters. Just saying, yeah. Luke is kind of being hypocritical here. I'll protect you, sis. Let's go. Oh, goodbye, Yuito. Nagi. That girl, Kasane Randall. She looks surprisingly like her. Those two. From the registration numbers, they're in the same class. Are they twins? She's so cute. Oh, Jesus Christ, Nagi. Naomi, she's so my type. Kasane is pretty too, but she's a little scary. Naomi is like her opposite. Shy and kind. She kept glancing at me and blushing. Man, this might finally be my big chance. <laughs> You're as simple as always. Whatever. Let's hurry to headquarters. What do you mean, whatever? Uh, you should be supportive when your best friend is in love. Yeah, yeah. Tell me all about it later. In Go. love? Bro, you met her for like two minutes. Then again, she did save him, so he's like in dance. He's like... He's in that distress mode, you know? You gain brain points when you level up. You can learn various skills by spending brain points on the brain map screen in the menu. 